It's the film critic who tells it like it is. Woody Whitman. The Hollywoody show is taped in front of a live studio audience. Yay. This week I'm reviewing the new dancing movie, Take the Lead, which tells the familiar story of a wise man who inspires poor, undereducated minorities and teaches them how to dance. Take the Lead stars the incomparable Antonio Benaderas. His character goes to a New York City public school and he reaches out to the students to show them the magic of ballroom dancing. Now, I've been a big fan of the fine art of dancing ever since the movie Breakdance 2 Electric Boogaloo. And back in the 90s, while in between jobs, I actually taught dancing part-time at Oliver Lodge Elementary School. <laughs> In the movie, there are a lot of fabulous dancing scenes with Mr. Banaderas. He's very good at it, and it's not surprising considering he's a Puerto Rican, or a Mexican, or French-Canadian. I'm not really sure what the difference is, and they all kind of blend to me. Nonetheless, this movie could not have been more timely with all the fierce debate going on in this country about illegal immigrants. I don't know how Mr. Banaderas gets away with making American movies while being here as a legal alien and sending our money back home to French Canada. Now, I'm not saying what side of the issue I'm on. Woody remains a political. Although the Mexican lady who cleans our house, Esmeralda, is very good. She washes my sheets every week and never asks a single question about the stains. <laughs> now that's professionalism. Esmeralda is wonderful. Although my mother is convinced she's stealing from us. My Entertainment Weekly summer movie preview did go missing last week, but I do not want to make false accusations. I've been on the other side of that coin. Whew. Despite a breathtaking performance by Banaderas, it's unfortunate that most Americans don't care at all about dancing, even with stars like Antonio, who are illegal aliens. But I'm not like most Americans, and so I give Take the Lead, wait for it, four Woodies. Great fun. Until next time, that's Holly Woody.